it's Katie and MyNaturalHappiness.com, creator of the Seeds of Change program to help you go from hamster oil to happiness, founder of Shine Your Light Goddess, Shine Your Light Bootcamp, and ready to go to Reiki. How are you? How are you getting on? I confess I, I came back from a holiday a couple of days ago and I'm still in a bit of holiday mode. Does it take anybody else a few days to land back into the work mode or is it just me? It always has. Um, and for me, I try and keep my keep things gentle the first couple of days and gently land back into it. And I'm still in a bit of holiday mode. Oh, it was so beautiful. If you're going on holiday, I hope you enjoy it so much. We had a family Christmas and it was so beautiful to be with family. And if you are reconnecting with any of your family members, then just enjoy so, so much. It was so beautiful. We swam in the sea. We walked in the forests. We had such a beautiful time. Um, and on the way back, I stopped off in Avebury. Sadly, the hen shop was closed. Oh, I will get there soon. Um, and I got to walk around the stones and see a couple of friends who live in the circle there. It was so so beautiful so yeah i hope you're doing well and i hope you're getting to enjoy the summer months as much as i am and i'm hoping that you're getting time yesterday i was talking about weaving in time for yourself as you land back into what is going on around us and uh, the opening up of lockdown restrictions in the uk i hope you're getting to weave in some time for you as well that's what Wednesday was about. We've in time for you as well. So I'm in holiday mode. I'm still in holiday mode. Here's your card for the week. Here is your card for the week. Shaolin Master. Be graceful in movement and action. I've only just read this. I'm just me saying uh, I'm still in a bit of holiday mode and I'm landing gently. This is what our card for the week has to say. Slow and steady. Breathe and flow. Take a gentler approach. The Shaolin Master calls forth the ninja within. Shaolin Medicine, I'm probably mispronouncing that, I'm so sorry, is about learning to adapt to a situation and to tap into the energy running through your body and preserve it in order to release it at the right moment. It also teaches subtlety because when you are too forceful, you use too much energy and that may not be supportive of what you are working on. The Shaolin master, like a monk, has respect for all things. He is disciplined by guiding his disciplined and guided by his art and will never use it to impress the few foolish or to appear stronger than someone who is threatening him. You too are being invited to remain graceful in your movement choices and actions. You are being guided like water, blow like air and connect to your purest intentions. Don't feel you need to rush ahead. A gentler approach will be more fruitful and rewarding. Move with subtlety and grace. Reach high but also ask yourself how you can move with the flow of life rather than pushing against it. Do you have capacity to refocus your gaze at this time? Can you slow down or take more time to soften and breathe as you move forward? All of this will be incredibly beneficial for what happens next. And this is so, so true. So being graceful in movement and action and flowing with the energy of what's going on around you. I am in a bit of holiday mode. I am easing back in. I'm, I'm not overwhelming myself as I step back in. And the, one of the reasons I'm doing that is I'm preparing to launch for the summer Shine Your Light Goddess, Shine Your Light Bootcamp. We'll be starting in around three, three and a half weeks' time, roughly. I haven't put all the dates, or well, I have put all the dates. I haven't worked out how many weeks it is from now because I'm still in holiday mode. In a couple of weeks' time, we'll be launching this summer Shine Your Light Goddess, Shine Your Light Bootcamp, and starting that uh, that that phase. And it's just a beautiful 
amazing sacred space to step into and it's always a busy busy couple of weeks in the run-up to it as people are joining as people are stepping into the space and as I get together all the copy ready to release out to you guys if you're interested in it drop me a message I will promise you I'll make sure that you're you're uh, updated as soon as the system goes live to uh, join and um, yeah so I know it's going to be a busy couple of weeks in the next couple of weeks so I'm flowing with the energy of just being a bit gentler a bit calmer this week so that I restore my energy reserves um, and take care of me before I step into service uh, with the Shine Your Light Goddess Shine Your Light Summer Boot Camp so yeah um, for going the flow of your energy even if it means that one day you get less done I know that by stepping into the flow of just being a bit calm I'll get more done tomorrow just by honouring my energy so it's such a powerful thing and I know when you're employed and working for someone else it's not not always so easy to do that and there's usually ways and means you can flow with your energy and even if it's flowing with your energy around what's going on around your work it can make a massive difference so yeah flowing with the energy of how you are doing and if you're feeling a bit relaxed take time out and be relaxed restore your energy reserves and then get ready to go on for me it's about having a gentler week so that I can step forward and just be ready to serve so summer shine your light goddess shine your light boot camp ah, we'll be coming soon so sending you a massive hug of love surrounding you with so much love honestly so many hugs enjoy getting back out to the work and the, the, the world and have the most amazing week with so much love kate mynaturalhappiness.com creator of the seeds of change to help you go from hamster to happiness founder of shine your light goddess shine your light boot camp ready school of reiki Mwah. have an amazing week lots of love take care